I know you're gonna dig this. Hey, TT, this is what happened, but you weren't here, so you missed it. I'm about to jump in the car and go shopping with Granny. Honey, I'll miss you terribly. Don't worry, whatever may happen, whatever may occur, I will find you. Hi, Granny. Oh, hi, daughter. <laughs> and everyone. And everyone out there who loves us like we love them. That's right. You ready to go shopping? Yes, we're ready. We're on our street. You're more than ready, right? It looks like a nice day out there. Yeah, they say the sun is supposed to come out, so we'll, well see. My iPhone said 60 degrees today, so. Oh, really? Well, yeah. That's, that's, well, we can uh, take that, right? Boy, you're like a hipster with your denim jacket on. Yeah, well, this is comfy, you know, yeah. when you're shopping in the store, sometimes it's hot, I can't take that heat, you know. Granny can't take it. No. Except when it's cold, and then she can't take the cold. <laughs> All right. All right, let's go. So we're in the toddler department here looking for something for Maddie, right? Because oh. she could practically fit into some of these clothes, I think she's so tiny. <laughs> well, Maddie's not that Maddie could definitely rock this, don't you think? That would fit Maddie. It's too short. It's, <laughs> it's a maxi it's skirt. <laughs> All right, Granny. So where are we going to come from now on for Sean? <laughs> Kmart. Kmart, of course. They have a huge oh, tall men's selection. selection. Oh, God. Good stuff. But then again, you'll see the uh, the fashion show when we get when I get home and I'll do the yeah. uh, big and tall <laughs> men's haul. Oh yeah, Granny's favorite store. Yeah, I haven't been in here for months. I don't know about that. We were what in here with it? Maddie. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. Yeah. Yeah, I forgot. That was when Maddie was home. Yeah. Right. All of these are perfect for Maddie. Really? This is Maddie style. Oh. Especially this white one here. I thought that polka dot one was cute. Oh, well, yeah, that too. But that's heavy. That's very heavy. No, now. it's lovely. Why, you already... Yeah. yeah. That's a heavy dress, you know. I don't know if that oh, would be comfortable. Maddie would just love wear. all of these, especially this one. You know how she loves the lace. Well, maybe I'll get her one. No, 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 Granny. Well, when she gets home, then. She don't deserve it. Oh, come on. <laughs> maybe don't when say she that. gets home. Hi. It's the okay. best time of the day. Mm. Did I just yeah. totally annihilate your foot? I'm okay. sorry. <laughs> I'm just so happy to see you. I love you. <laughs> Oh, I got you a present. I see. It's uh, those lights that you like so much that change colors. Yeah. Uh, solar. Those are nice. That's the little LED. Mm. Isn't that cool? Cool. So, well, Mark's taking that out. Look at these awesome shirts that I got for Sean. They're like so long. This is like practically a dress. I could. Look at, take the camera. I can actually wear this as a dress. Is that too long for him? Oh, no. You're not a rabbit. I can actually wear this as a dress. All right. Wear it later. <laughs> How sick is that? And Well, you might as well just hold it. This one's not as long, but. <laughs> back all the way up. <laughs> That's a mini. That's obscene. All right, that's the same. That one's pretty long. Not, not quite, this is kind of a Cindy Brady. But that other one, that's a freaking dress. <laughs> All right. So here's my haul. <laughs> I did mostly the um, clearance section. We went to Kmart, which by the way, I did not realize they had Gordon Ramsay dishes at uh, Kmart. I didn't get any because they weren't on sale, but oh my god, that's something to think about in the future. And Sandra Lee. Hi, Sean. Hi. <laughs> I love everything that Sandra Lee has. Guess what she had? The avocado thing that I wanted. What about uh, the governor of Cuomo? You love him too? No. <laughs> no. She just basically, um, she got the right to like fly free and everything with him, even though they're not together, together. Whatever. Yeah, they're like domestic partners or whatever. Anyway, I got some granite cleaner for five bucks at 
TJ, yeah, TJ's clearance. I got this mug for $4.99. They had a real, you know I'm all about the coffee mugs, guys, because I live drinking hot drinks. <laughs> I'm definitely not Mormon. All right, because I drink too many hot drinks. That is confirmed, isn't that? That Mormons don't drink hot drinks? I think so. Yeah. If you're Mormon, leave it in the comments, because I just, I want to learn. But anyway, they had two different mugs, well, actually three. You know, there was a whole lot of mugs that I liked. It was really hard to narrow it down, and TJ's has the best mugs. But I felt instantly connected to this one, and I turned uh, it over, and I see that it's made in Poland. So I thought, wow, that's really cool, because everything is usually made in China. And isn't it? cool to have something that's out of the ordinary so this one's from Poland so I got this one so I really like that it's got little butterflies on it similarly when I was in the clearance aisle I saw this and I just about fell over on the floor because I immediately got drawn to this and then I picked it up and I felt it and it felt like amazing just run your fingers on the inside of that the the uh, china on that is so fine. It's like a urinal. It's not a urinal. <laughs> Doesn't that feel amazing? It's excellent, huh? It's a berry bowl. Yeah. You know, you uh, rinse off your berries or cherry tomatoes, whatever, and it's the colander. I'll rinse off my tomatoes in it. <laughs> it's being na he's being naughty. They had lots of different kinds, but this one... The minute I picked it up and I felt what it felt like on the inside, I was just like, I must have this. And it was only uh, six bucks, so. It's, uh, this one's from China, unfortunately. But this one's from Poland. <laughs> Honey, this one's from Poland. Super. Excellent. You can never have <laughs> enough of these, especially when I have a thousand whisks and spoons and um, spatulas. So this is another tool caddy. For like three bucks. That's not too bad. I see every one of the freaking makeup gurus has this Milani blush. And they say that it's a dupe for the, um, like Laura Geller or the uh, MAC Baked. Um, I want to try it. And Granny actually got one too. <laughs> so you know it's good. Good stuff. I got uh, rose gold. And I haven't been able to... Um, find the hard candy one back in oh look at that in uh, Walmart because I won't go to Walmart Sean is just being so loud today isn't he but you know what it's not out of the ordinary because that's every day he comes home from school and he does a monologue that lasts for about 40 minutes <laughs> and it is so loud <laughs> these are just like the other ones similar we'll see, we'll see. can you turn it on so we can see what it looks like um no I don't even know if I could Oh, it's probably not even charged up because it was in a box. So, yeah, let leave that under and we'll check back on that and see how that turns out. Now, this was just on the clearance. You know I love Danny Seo. More storage containers because of all my flowers and everything, so that's pretty cool. I think this was only like 5 bucks. Good deal. It's eco-friendly. And I've been looking for a raised um thing to feed Flash on because I don't want him to choke. He's got a very sensitive uh, throat. Mm. If you pull on his collar or like you walk him and you put the leash on his collar, he he chokes very easily. So that's why we have to use a harness with him. Not because he will pull out of the collar, but because he just has a very sensitive throat. So I wanted to get one of these. I have Verdell's food raised up on a thing. And I got this because it's non-stick on the top. And I can use it as a step stool too when he's not eating off of it. But the thing about this is um, the dog feeders are very expensive. The dog feeders that are raised up, some of them for his height are like $50. I kind of made a cheaper one. This was only nine bucks and I can use it to um, step up and get stuff out of the cabinet when I don't want to take the big stairs out. It's good, honey, trust me. Oh, wow, that's cool. Let me turn off the light. Ah, very nice. Are you happy with that? I guess, we'll see at night. Yeah, you should put it out there now so it could charge up a little bit. See how it compares to the other ones, although it doesn't have 
the full charge that the other ones have had. Right. The other one has had. Now we got three. It's so hot. All right, so I got that step stool. I'm really liking this more and more now that I look at it, and it'll fit in between the cabinets when it's all folded up if I don't want it out. And then I got this at Kmart. This is so posh, isn't it? This folds so you can put it away during the um, off season. Dream on. This thing will be rusted in two years. <laughs> it will not. It will. You can actually put that in the basement and hang your plants on it. Oh. For when we bring them in for... Uh, you're making fun of me and you're standing there with a freaking flashlight? <laughs> I know. You can hang a plant on this part right here. Or you could put a plant at the bottom. Or you can do both. Oh, thanks for just shining that on me. He's such a little scamp. Alright guys, this is the moment you've been waiting for. I'm going to make vegan yogurt. I think it's raw too. <clears throat> By the way though. This one's not going to be vegan because I bought this yogurt starter and I didn't realize it had dairy in it. I won't be buying that again because I've just been doing some research and I found out you don't actually have to even put that in. It makes its own bacteria, right? <laughs> There's enough cat and dog feces flying around this house for it to make its own bacteria, I'm sure. don't think that's the right kind. I don't know. Mark says he doesn't think that's the right kind. I'm not so sure. <laughs> I think just everyday bacteria. Anyway, I was just eating some cashews, so sorry. But if you really do want to put in the, um, the active cultures, you can use um, ac acidophilus. If you've got like um, Philips Colon Health or any of those, just throw a couple of those in. I actually read people who make yogurt using those. What's this? So, let's get started. <laughs> On that note, two cups of cashews raw. And you grind these into a fine powder. So I'm going to put these in my ninja. By the way, there's lots of recipes out there. I'm trying the simplest one first. Some of them use agave. Some of them use, you know, different things. Some say soak the cashews first. Some say you don't have to. But it's very basic. It's just the two cups of cashews and three cups of water. And I'm going to add this today. But probably when I use this up, I won't be using it anymore. Or, like I said, I'll put, like, the Philips Colon Health in there or a few acidophilus uh, capsules or a batch, you know, like a couple of tablespoons of a batch of the previous yogurt. I'm excited to use the um, yogurt maker. I washed all my little jars completely in the dishwasher so they're all like sanitized because I put them on hot. So I'm going to get that uh, blended up and show you what it looks like. All right, so there it is. It's all in the little jars and here's the last little jar to go in the machine. It holds these um without the lid on the lid is for when it goes in the refrigerator it's got to sit in the machine turned on with the lid on top because it's gonna condense and grow <laughs> for about 12 hours i guess it says anywhere from like 8 to 12 hours some recipes even say like 24 hours i guess it depends on if you use probiotics or not um and like i said you really don't have to some people just put it in a mason jar and put it under their counter and let it sit for like overnight or for a day. So I'm going to use the machine and I'm going to try 12 hours. Well, I'll check it after 8 hours. I'll let it go to 12 hours, see, see what I think at 12 hours and uh, hopefully it'll be good. I don't know. I'm going to make dairy yogurt too in case Mark wants that, but um, he may not want it if he really likes the cashew. So we'll see what happens. That's all we can do. Oh, hello. How are you? And how are you? They're waiting for their dinner. I'm just starting ours. Uh, I got some Morningstar Grillers crumbles, can of black beans, some taco sauce. I'm gonna add a little water, gonna microwave that. Then I've got some Spanish rice over here. I guess I gotta cut up some veggies and stuff to go with all that. Ooh, the yogurt's looking amazing! Only 11 hours to go. <laughs> 
more and more. Howdy, stranger. Hey. Where have you been, Dish? <laughs> you know where I was. Blah, blah time. Blur, 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 blur. <laughs> same old, same old, huh? Mm. <sighs> We're having quite a spread here. You got some beautiful Spanish oh, rice. Crap. If you don't, what's, oh, you're going to make a uh, burrito? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Ooh, look at that. That turned out quite oh, nice, crap. didn't it? Kristen uh, is having some meat with her day. <laughs> Someone take some. I took too much. Oh. You have no real cheese? Yes, we do have real oh. cheese. Cukes, some sriracha, some Thousand Islands. Sriracha? Yes. <laughs> Why? What's so funny? That's been in the basement for like months and I've been meaning to try it and uh -huh. here it is right now. Right. It's extremely hot. So if you value your stomach, only use a little bit. It's on your brother. Yeah, well, he's probably had it already. For some reason, my family likes really hot food. Like my dad loved hot food. Why are you putting that on the cheese if you're not keeping it all? Yeah, exactly. Videl says, I want some sriracha, even though that's not from my country. <laughs> uh, I think you can have a little bit more than that. Seriously. Is that a Kristen joke? We'll top it off at three. <laughs> Uh-oh. You, you've exceeded your limit. Bye. <laughs> All right, we're going to eat. Uh-oh, you're going to think that's really hot. <laughs> Is it really hot? <laughs> it's, um, <laughs> I just tried to look it up. It takes a while. Yes, it doesn't. Now it's getting. Yeah, it gets really hot and it, it develops. My throat is raw to begin with, so it's not. How a is it? Thing. I didn't look at it. <laughs> <clears throat> Maybe if you mix it with a little sour cream and make like Yo, a I spicy sour cream. cream. Sake it took my cheese. <sighs> Give some to Daddy. Oh, Daddy I doesn't want. want Daddy doesn't want Daya. Daddy wants real cheese. All right, I gotta take Kristen's cheese off her hands now. Hi. It's dessert time. <laughs> And I am so stuffed from dinner, I couldn't eat another bite. So I'm not going to have dessert tonight or anything. I'm just going to have a cup of coffee. And, oh, I'm so excited for these little goodies. Mark told me that these came in the mail when I was out with Granny. So, my new Veg News magazine, the music issue. What? Travis Barker, you're vegan. No way. Alright, so there's lots of good stuff in there. And my health issue um, looks like some good stuff. Jewel's on the cover. She's looking pretty hot. Good stuff. So, yeah. I'm going to enjoy those while it, with my cup of coffee. I just watched Idol. Good show this week. And uh, I got to work tomorrow. But guess what? Mark is home. <laughs> I wish he would just vlog without me. You know, and then add me when I get home, but I don't know if he'll do that or not. I'm thinking no. But, oh, vlog bomber. <laughs> Were you vlog bombing? Um, I'm really upset right now. Uh-oh. All right. Because the cat knocked over the cat genie. Luckily, it was empty. <laughs> Her, I thought I heard something crash before. By the way, that shirt is hella cute. Did Granny get that for you? really cute. Check that out. It's got a little zipper on the side. Oh, Get a little neck. zipper side. Zipper, <laughs> zipper neck. Yeah. Get a little zipper neck. Remember that from Young Frankenstein? I have to go clean that up after we're done. I thought you said it was empty. Well, it, that part was, but the little thing that holds the scooper had cat litter accumulated in it, so I have to clean it. I can't deal with it right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, I don't care. It's not my room. <laughs> Another vlog bomber. Everybody wants you to vlog tomorrow while I'm at work. No. <laughs> I told you. He said no. Alright, so don't worry. I'll get plenty of footage for you guys. Till next time. Much love. Mr. Page, Mr. Page.